What is going on guys, DBG here, in this video we're going to be doing gameplay with the new point guard Kevin Durant card. So lads, if you guys are new to the channel, subscribe, we're trying to hit 200,000 subscribers as soon as possible, and we are literally like we are just over 9,000 off, it's looking like we're going to hit that in the next couple of weeks, which would be absolutely insane. But anyway, also, also, if we could hit, I'm going to set a ridiculous like goal, 1,000 likes in the first hour. To get this card out within 90 minutes. Where is he? Oh, sorry. He's a point guard. Jonathan Isaac. Jonathan Isaac. If we can get 1,000 likes in the first hour, we got Jonathan Isaac straight away. But anyway, we got Kevin Durant, Kawhi, Scotty, Siakam, Shaq. For the bench, we're going to go with Thon, Michael Jordan, Richard Lewis, Larry Bird, and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. So anyway, this is the team that we are running with. Now let's get on to the stats for KD. So Kevin Durant. 54 Hall of Fame badges, Floor General, Post Spin Ignition, Range Extender, Quick Draw, Ice and Veins, Flexible Release, Pick Dodger, Clamps, Interceptor, Intimidator, Dead Eye, Rebound Chaser, Pogo, Unpluckable, Tight Handle, Stop and Go, Contact Finisher, Space Creator, Fancy Footwork, Quick First Step, Downhill, Handles for Days, as well as that, he has got um, unbelievable stats. Like, he may as well have 99 in every stat. Like, he may as well be a go card. Yeah, he doesn't have the best rebound stats, but he's a point guard. He may as well be a go-card. Tennessee's are quite big. So, Tennessee's got a 34 on ball steal tendency, which is not ideal. I don't think he's going to be the most elite defensive card in the world, but you know what? Offensively, I think he's going to be a demon. He's going to be a god. So, um, yeah, we got Durant, Kawhi, Scotty, Siakam, and Shaq. Then Thon, Jordan, Lewis, Bird, and Kareem. So, now we're going to get on to the hot zones and release for Kevin Durant. Then we're going to get on to the game. So, Kevin Durant hot zones. He actually doesn't... There's a spot that's not hot in the court. Which is an absolute shock. It is an absolute shock. Kevin Durant's release is Kevin Durant's release. At the end of the day, we know what these re this release is like. I am not the biggest fan. I'm just going to say that right now. I am not the biggest fan of Kevin Durant's release. I was not the biggest fan of his last uh, Galaxy Opal card. But again, this one, it's going to be different. Why? Because he can play a different position. <laughs> I don't know. I think, I think he's still going to be God tier. Like, he's going to be right up there. I don't think he'll be any, like, I don't think he'll be T-Mac good. I'm saying that right now because T-Mac has a um, way better jumper. So I like I still don't see him being T-Mac good. But I do see him being a very, very, very good point guard in this game. And I think he might even be one of the absolute elite two guys in this game. So anyway, yeah. Um, he's got, as far as I know, he's got long athlete hop step. So yeah, he has long athlete, which is the Anna's hop step. So that's really, really good. So I said between and behind the back. So... Behind the back, he's got... I don't like that behind the back. I don't like the Pro 2 tween spam, to be honest. I prefer Pro 8 if you're tween spamming. However, if you're doing a single tween, I think the Pro 2 is probably the best for spacing. For me, anyway. But, um, yeah, so he's going to be a really nice shooter. He's going to be, be able to do a little bit of everything. Like, and as well as that, he's going to be a 6-9 point guard. And even though he's got a skinny player build, he's got really high strength, so he's not going to get bullied at all. He's going to be able to guard people inside, outside. He's basically a hidden, he's a go card in disguise. So, yeah, should be quite fun. Now it's green on three. And, come on. It's an early reading. Oh, we are struggling. Now let's get on to the game. Okay, so we're playing against a tough team right here. But to be fair, every team's going to be tough. Every team's pretty much tough in my team right now. So he's got Glenn, Larry, Mikhail, Gasol, and Simmons the one. We should be okay. Our bench is elite. Yeah, we have a big bench advantage. Actually, his bench is pretty nice. They're just, they're just being diamonds. They are pretty nice, but we should be okay. Like, it would take me kind of crumbling or him just being a very good player to lose this game. Oh, and that's a good um, tip there. I'm trying to cross over in his face, which isn't ideal. And he goes and hits the white moving shot. Okay, he come there. Come there. Come there for the handoff. And we run. We run into the rim. Trigger a dunk. Gasol was right there. We actually got sucked into Gasol, if anything. Okay. You know what? Why not? Why not? See what happens. This isn't 2K19, unfortunately. He can't fade away from the three-point line with Limitless. That was one of the mad things about 19, wasn't it? He's hit two wide threes. Start the game. Great. Dunk that. Good, Durant. Let's go. Jesus, even after a make, he still has coloring. It's fine. No, it doesn't mean he can't dunk. Paint, oh, sit in front. Sit in front. We're there. Oh, we were just off. We were just off as the game gives him three whites in a row. 
he has hit like he's on, like he is hitting a white three pointer every single possession. Literally every possession in this game so far, he's hit a white three. Good job there, but KD going to the basket. Right to the basket. I'm one. Let's go, KD. My KD's dunking is nice. KD moves well. That's all I'm going to say. He moves well. Like, he feels fluid when he moves. Which I know some people are going to argue that's not that's not a real thing. But, like, everyone who's played this game knows there's some players that move well and there's some players that feel clunky. He def most definitely uh, is not clunky whatsoever as he goes and greens the three right there. Let's go. Now KD's coming into it. Now KD's in his element. We have the lead right here. And KD with the steal. Okay, we made a bad attempt to walk back there. We got open. As uh, Kevin Durant greens another three. Let's go. Just like that, 13 points for Kevin Durant. Yeah, a bad first minute or so of his game. He still has 13 points in three minutes despite missing, I think, his first three shots. We're waiting. We're there. We're there. Ha, let's go. Moving. Sold. But, God, ah, Kevin Durant can't hit it. So hoping the game will give me a white. We're there. No need to foul fine. Try to around with Kevin McHale. You're not going to go by Siakam with McHale on the perimeter. You might be able to take me inside with him, but not in the perimeter. We got him clamped. We got him clamped. We got this pass denied. It's the only place he can go. It's the only place he can go. He shoots the fade, up, fade away and managed to get it out to Larry. Shoots the full white. Can't hit it. Gets another offensive board. We got him clamped though. We got him clamped. He's boxed. He's in a box right now. He's going to pass the ball right into a guy being blocked by Kevin Durant. Let's go. They're getting another... Oh, thank God. If they didn't airball that, they were probably getting another offensive board. Someone just come for him. And Simmons has done that twice now to him. Oh, that's unfortunate. And the worst thing is it's off ball on Simmons. I can deal with someone getting a steal on me on ball, but like he's just sitting off ball. KD hit the white. Let's go. I don't think... I've just missed a wide open. Maybe with Shaq, but I don't think I've been in my freelance all game if that's where my players went on a pass and screen away. That's another block there by Kevin Durant, though. Durant trail on the play. And that's green. There's 19 first quarter. For Actually, no, I'll leave KD in. I'll leave KD in. We just take over. I'm going to leave him in. Start second. Almost another steal. And he's got length. KD has got length. Unfortunately, I made the sub before uh, I saw you take over. Wide open. Green. Let's go. I think I'll be able to get this guy to rage quit very, very quickly. Because he's, going, he's playing a, zone, a bait zone where he's just leaving my players wide open. And also this lineup is better than my starters. And I'm not just shooting one player. I got an all half range. Like. Uh, everyone just get into a position to shoot the ball. And that's a green from there from Larry. So yeah, just like that, we have him by 14. And he's gone long. He's starting to throw. He's starting to throw risky passes. And Kareem plays all five lanes. Kareem is the best card in history of my team. And it's not even close. It is not even close. I, again, having played five Kareem Abdul-Jabbar's, even a bad player using this guy can get in every lane. Like, it is ridiculous. Back court. There we go. One minute into this quarter, we managed to make this. He went, did he go 9-0 up or something? I went up 30 to 13. KD, it's open. And that is off. KD is open again, though. And it's green. Good shot. Kareem, wide open for three, and that's green. Kareem is one of the best releases in the game. Like, I said it when Rudy LaRusso came out, that he is one of the best releases in the game. Oh, basket side. Good layup there by Kareem. Oh, Kareem with sharp, Kareem with sharp takeover. That makes things a lot more interesting. And Kareem, as always, plays every lane. On the break, green. This is the most broken card in my team history. Like, they will never, you will, like, there is no card that 2K can possibly make this better than Kareem. Including an 99 Ebony Giannis. There's actually no card that can make this better than this card right here. The release is too fast. The release is just too fast. There's nothing they can do. And at 17 points for Kareem. Oh my god. We have 56 first half points and we didn't score for the first two minutes of the game. Maybe. Oh my god, he hits that. <laughs> we have 60. Like, this dude's actually half decent. Like, he's not. 
He's not incredible. Like, he's not terrible either. But, like, I am up by 43 points at halftime. He's got Glenn. He's got Opals. Like, he's not awful. Like, it is just, that is the power of Kareem. Kareem can turn a game. Like, when you're using Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, you can be in a game where you might, if two even players played, and one of them had Kareem and the other one didn't, the guy with Kareem wins 100% of the time. It is the most broken card in my team history. Like, I'm telling you right now, like, for, like, tournaments and stuff, this card needs to be banned. It needs to be banned. It is ridiculous. It's basically a case of if you don't have Kareem, you've lost. Right into the post. Shoot the fade. Green. Good shot. KD. Let's go. KD dominating as well. Like, as much as this has been the Kareem show, it's also been the Kevin Durant show. After a bit of a rough start, Kevin Durant's been exceptional. That's no defense by me whatsoever. We're shooting 76% from the field. And I've shot eight more shots. KD with that cross. Burns Ben Simmons. Great dunk there. He's now got 30. He can do a little bit of everything. Not going to lie. Kevin Durant is... He's up there with the best point guys in the game. That's... I don't know where the 51% was from, but apparently it was. Track back. Unlucky. So I was just there at 50% from three with Kevin Durant. I don't like the behind the back though whatsoever. Fade. Good shot, KD. Unlucky. That's my fault with the timing. Good defense, Scotty Pippen. KD on that right wing. On that right wing. On the move. Sold. But it's in. Let's go. This guy really does have the Hall of Fame pride badge, doesn't he? He has the Hall of Fame pride badge, not quitting this game. While down, 42 points. This is where you need to bring in a Mercy Rail 2 okay? This is really where you need to bring in a Mercy Rail. Or maybe Floater. Yeah, that's on. And he blew it. But we, got, we still got the two points from a goal end. Oh, man. Even when he misses, he scores. Even when he misses, he still manages to get two points. Okay, let's cross. They double. They leave Siakam. I'm just gonna take that. That's green. Good shot. That is Kevin Durant's second assist of the game. 145 to go, we need 11 more for 100. He needs 15 more. He hasn't actually scored in this quarter. And he still hasn't scored in the quarter because we can't green right now. Hit him, hit him, hit him. And again, it's Siakam they're leaving open every single time. Like, they're, double, they're doubling completely for Kevin Durant. Whether it's off a screen or going to the basket, they're just completely surrounding him. Scotty is a god in defense. He is straight up a god in defense. I hate I hate the card offensively, but for game plays, he's the perfect player. Him Like, Bill Russell would become, like, my new game play small forward. As in, their job is just to clamp up people and do nothing else. That's his range. And we arrow three it. Okay. Just wait in the lane. Wait in the lane. He's going to pass straight into my hands. Let's go. We're open. We're open. We sold. We are not open this time. We need to We need to connect off this. We need to connect off this, which we do. And he's right there with Simmons. In and out. Has, I don't think KD's hit a white out game, has he? Okay. We're out running. We're out running. Kevin Durant, do not... Uh, blow this. Good dunk. 40. Not bad showing. Not a bad showing at all. Let's make that 100 for the game. How is that a slightly late? Oh my god. Alright, so we won that by 27 in the end. We lost that second half by 15. I was bad there. I was bad. So in the end, Kevin Durant under 50% from the field, under 50% from three. A lot of that was from forced, but he did get two blocks early in the game. Um, two steals, two assists, and 40 points. So really good game. So anyway, that's the video. This Kevin Durant card is exceptional. Is he that much better than like a Hedo type card? He's a, he's better. Is he better than T-Mac? I'm going to say no. I think he's a top five, six point guard in the game. He's a top three or four, two guard in the game, honestly. He's a very, very good card. Not my type of card, probably someone that, but he's brilliant. Again, like at this stage in the game, every single card is basically perfect. That's why it's all his preference and I'm not the biggest fan of KD's animations. Anyway, that's the video. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.
blast off. Get ready for take blast off. off. Take off. Pilot. Pilot. Already told you I'm a one-on-one. I'm about to bust the whole summer up.